1896. The first in the modern history International Olympic Games are held in Athens, Greece. The gold rush starts in the region of Klondike in Canada. And the first Russian car, the Yakulev Frezia, is presented at an exhibition in Nizhny Novgorod. However, people of the Kazakh steppe still consider horse as their main vehicle. Contrary to popular belief, not everyone possessed a horse. Less wealthy people used oxen. And that is what the picture of a famous 19th century photographer, Konstantin de Lazari, proves. The picture was taken in Akmolinsk region, in the town of Kukshatau. The oxen were used for all kind of purposes, winter or summer. In the same years, Samuel Dudin took a picture of a boy next to an ox cart and a two-wheeler in Semipalatinsk region. The little master carefully drags an ox on the rope, treating the animal with the grass. And this careful attitude is quite understandable. Cattle was a reliable assistant for loads transporting. Also, it was used for plowing, as this picture from the Turkestan album shows. Bull riders were common, too. In one ethnographic review of 1877, the life of the Kazakhs was described. And it was mentioned that the Kazakhs preferred not to walk, even for a short distance. And if there was no horse, they would ride a cow or a bull. In the 19th century, this kind of vehicle was common in both steppe and cities. Therefore, people sitting on the bull's backs were photographed very often, like this man from Almaty, who is riding the animal masterly, or this old man on the streets of Shimkent. This phenomenon was also reflected in the works of famous creative personalities. Shokan Walikhanov used to mention bull rides, and the artist Abul Khan Kasteyev painted the painting called Almaty Gorge, where in the foreground we can see a child on a bull. Konstantin de Lazari, being the head of the Lepsi Uyezd of the Simirieche region and participating in the census of the population of the Russian Empire, tried to capture all distinctive features of the life of the Kazakh people in his photographs. His contemporaries said that his work were highly anticipated at the Peter the Great Museum of Anthropology and Ethnography, better known as Kunstkamera. Bright and unique pictures, such as this one, attracted people's attention. They are still kept there, in St. Petersburg. Thanks to them, we know that a bull pulling a sleigh was a part of our history.